Wells Fargo is being hit with a $190 million fine for creating fake customer accounts that regulators say were illegal. Prosecutors allege the bank pushed customers into costly financial products they didn't need or ask for. They say employees created some 2 million ghost deposit and credit accounts under pressure to generate more sales. Ken Wallman of Venice, California says he confronted his Wells Fargo branch after discovering 13 unauthorized accounts in his name. I went in with my big pile and I said, what is this? It's important that these, these companies uh, play by the rules, basically. You know, it just has to happen. Wells Fargo says it regrets and takes responsibility for what happened. It's also fired over the past five years some 5,300 employees involved in the fraudulent practice. About half of the $190 million fine will go to the Consumer Financial Protection Bureau, while $5 million goes back to customers.